Hi guys, it's Matt and Busby here and we're going to run you through this month's activity box. Now March's box is all about planting your own vegetable seeds. Now let's take a look in the box. What I'm looking for in here is something which we can plant the seeds into. Ah, these will be perfect. Here I've got three plant pots. One, two, three. Now the next step is to fill these plant pots up with something which we can plant the seeds into. So let's have a look again in here. And here we go, we've got a bag of compost. This is gonna be perfect. So what you need to do is open up your bag of compost, just like this, and there's gonna be the perfect amount to fill these three pots. So you've gotta get your hands in, this is the fun part. It's a little bit messy, but it's great fun. And you're gonna fill these pots right up to the top. So that's one. There's two, and then this is the third one. And I think actually I'm gonna have a little bit of spare compost for the end, which will be great. So there we are, you can see I filled that pot right to the top. Now next, we need to find something to plant in the pots. And I'm gonna have a look in the box again. In here we should have, there we go, some seeds. Now we've got three different types of seeds here. We've got peas, sweet corn, and runner beans. Now these are three of our favourite seeds, Busby, aren't they? These are really exciting to grow. So what we want to do, we're going to start with the peas and inside this envelope here, if you open yours up and take a look, you'll be able to see you've got three pea seeds there. So these seeds, all you've got to do is poke these down into the pots that we've just filled with compost. And if you space them out as well, in a sort of triangle shape, that will give them plenty of space to grow. So what I'm going to do next is I'm going to do exactly the same with the sweet corn and with the runner beans. So let's have a look. This is the sweet corn. Two, three, there we go. And then the runner beans. Now these are exciting seeds. Take a look at these. They're very unusual and they've got light black spots on them as well. So they're quite an exciting big seed to plant. And the same again with these. One, two, three three. There we go. So that's all of our seeds planted. And what we can do now, if you've got a little bit of leftover compost, is just put a bit more on top of those seeds that we've planted. How's that looking, Busby? Looking good? Fantastic. And the last one, there we go. And now the final bit that we need to do to these pots is to give them a little drink, because plants need water to grow. So we're going to, we've got this, this is your favourite watering can, this Busby, isn't it? Bright yellow. And you just give them a little water like that, just to wet the compost. Now it's important that you find a nice sunny spot for these to go and grow. Now the best place is if you've got a windowsill and you can put a little tray underneath them, that'll catch any drips. You can see this one is dripping a little bit, any drips of water. And these plants are gonna grow lovely on the windowsill. And in a couple of weeks time, you're gonna be able to watch these and see the shoots grow up. So what you should do is keep an eye on these now over the next weeks and months, and then when they get a little bit bigger, you'll be able to take them outside and plant them on into a bigger pot and watch your vegetables grow. So that's it for this month, nice and simple. Next month, we're growing sunflowers. So make sure you get your activity box for next month and join me and Busby here to go through next month's activities. Have fun planting, guys. Bye-bye.